Meantime, a San Diego captain is making history by leading the first ever team to tack and track great white sharks. 10 News reporter Dan Haggerty spoke to Captain Brett McBride just hours ago. He is live at Sunset Cliffs with how his team is now able to alert authorities when great whites swim too close to shore. Dan. Well, they use live GPS tracking and they've been able to see some amazing things. For instance, these sharks traveling from the coast here in San Diego to Hawaii and back several times a year. They hope that this technology will help save sharks and people. A 16 foot shark Get out of there. named Mary Lee. She's a 3,500 pound North Atlantic great white caught in September in the fictitious home of Jaws, just off the coast of Cape Cod. A daring encounter that's become just another day at work for the ship's captain, San Diego native Brett McBride. Started fishing in uh, Point Loma on some of the boats down there when I was about five. <laughs> that definitely had a big influence on, on my uh, love for the ocean. A love that's taken him to the deck of this boat and face to face with great whites. Oh yeah, Mary Lee! <laughs> and this man, expedition leader Chris Fisher, tagging sharks with GPS trackers in their dorsal fins. Now, each month, more than a million people hop online to follow along with Mary Lee and nearly 40 other sharks. In just the past six months, she made her way down the East Coast more than a thousand miles, hugging the coastline most of the way. I had to call the authorities in Jacksonville Beach. Look at this, she was oh, within wow. 200 yards of a surf spot in a public pier. A helpful technology for the people who take to the beaches in San Diego and for the sharks, people like Captain McBride want to protect. I know it in my heart when I look at it. Um, now we can get data to really actually prove it. And we have this shark tracker online. If you're sitting around, you got the laptop nearby, open it up, take a look. Uh, go to our website, 10news.com, click on the red television button, and you can get on there and track at least 40 different sharks. Pretty amazing. And of course, our coverage on this topic will continue tonight on Nightline starting at 1235. Reporting live tonight, I'm Dan Haggerty, 10 News.